I got the time belt all put back together and fixed the issue that's a common problem on these Toyota V8s, it's the 1998 LS400, is uh, you go to take the alternator out and what happens is the electrical plug to the back of the alternator will just break apart. You can be as gentle as you want with it and it's just going to shatter like glass. So, ordered a new part, new pigtail, brand new, put the rubber uh, boot back on, soldered it, shrunk wrap underneath, and then electrical taped it up to make it waterproof. And uh, before you cut the old one off, hold it in a position that you can remember. What I did is those white little squares. I oriented it, took a picture of the wiring so I could see all three wires. That way I knew which way it went back on, and then I clipped it and then looked back at the photo as a reference. So what happens is the power steering pump sits up here and the alternator is below it. The power steering pumps are known to leak right on top of the uh, alternator. Also the cam seal will leak right on top of it. it fried the alternator. Here's the old one covered in oil and power steering fluid or transmission fluid. Here's the new one. Here's the part number. Right here. You can see that. 909-80-11349. There it is. Toyota Pigtail. Sumitomo TS three-way alternator plug pigtail. So there you go. It's a little awkward uh, getting down there to solder. So, uh, pick you up one of these let's see get this uh, wiring uh, shrink wrap kit from Harbor Freight and then this is a gas propane powered uh, soldering gun that'll make it a little easier so that's nice and then the butane for the it doesn't come with butane for the soldering gun I just got a can at a uh, Home Depot for like five bucks. So yeah, hopefully that helps you guys out and uh, y'all take it easy.